Hola y bienvenidos a esta presentación del imperfecto del subjuntivo y el condicional. This video will talk about using the imperfect subjunctive and the conditional tenses with C clauses. These are used when we want to say something like, if I won the lottery, I would. Si yo pudiera correr más rápido, yo jugaría deportes profesionales. What this sentence is telling us is that if I could run faster, I would play professional sports. This type of C clause is contrary to, to fact in the present. I cannot play professional sports. It is impossible at the moment. But if I could run faster, I would play professional sports. If I could run faster, the if part of a if statement using the conditional and the imperfect subjunctive is always going to be conjugated in the imperfect subjunctive. What you would do or what one would do is always going to be in the conditional. The difficult thing for students is to remember which conjugation goes which which goes with which section of the sentence. An easy way to remember what goes with what is to remember that the imperfect subjunctive, IS, goes with the C part, SI. So you're going to keep the letters IS and SI together. Again, the imperfect subjunctive is always used to express the C part of a C clause. So if we look at this example, if I ate less, I would lose weight. The if part, if I ate less, is going to be in the imperfect subjunctive, si yo comiera menos. And what you would do is in the conditional, yo bajaría de peso. Now it's really important to remember that the C clause is used with the imperfect subjunctive. I'm sorry, the imperfect subjunctive is used with the C clause. Because in English and in Spanish, I can say, if I ate less, I would lose weight, or I would lose weight if I ate less. Students also sometimes assume that the imperfect subjunctive always comes first, but as we see here, yo bajaría de peso si yo comiera menos, our imperfect subjunctive comiera is at the end of the sentence. So to review, you need to keep the imperfect subjunctive with the C clause of the sentence, no matter where it may be. Practiquemos. Si ellos hablaran el español mejor, se comunicarían con más personas. Hablaran is with the C part of the sentence. It needs the imperfect subjunctive. Tú sacarías buenas notas si tuviera tiempo para estudiar. You would get good grades if you had time to study. In this case, the sentence has been reversed and the conditional is at the beginning of the sentence with the section that states what you would do. José llegaría a tiempo si se duchara por la noche. He would arrive on time. We need the conditional to express what he would do. Las chicas saldrían con los chicos si fueran más románticos. The imperfect subjunctive of ser is fueran for los chicos. And in this final example, both parts are missing. Yo te daría dinero si tú lo necesitaras. Gracias por ver este video y te deseo mucho éxito.